Good morning, everyone. Welcome to ESO 2024. I have here with me today Dr. Andrew Malum. He is a pediatric consultant from Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi. Welcome, Dr. Andrew. How are you? Very good, thank you. Thanks for having me. Thank you. Since you were one of the main instructors of pediatric wet lab today, how did you find the wet lab? Uh, I think it was very successful. I think um, there was a good attendance. Everyone was very enthusiastic, keen to learn. I think it's, um, I believe it's the first time you've run an, an ESO wet lab for strabismus. So it's a big achievement on your behalf. And yes. Dr. Aruna, so you deserve some congratulations because I know it's a lot of work. But um, it's a critically important element of training the next generation. So um, I think it was very successful on the whole. Great, thank you for your positive feedback. So as long as it was successful, do you think we need to run more of pediatric wet lab in the future? Yeah, so um, we're very fortunate as ophthalmologists to be um, in a specialty where it's surgical and clinical. And so just as we travel the world attending conferences to learn the theory, uh, we have to develop our surgical skills as well. And pro we should always do as much as we can before touching a patient that that's possible. And, and wet labs are a critical element of that. And so they're absolutely essential. And every time we do it, we learn from the previous time and we get better and better and better. So um, I look forward to the future. Yeah. Wet labs. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. We hope we will work together to making more successful mm -hmm. pediatric wet lab. And as you know, also, this was the first wet lab to be conducted and arranged fully by the Emirates Society of Ophthalmology for the first time this year. So how did you find it? Yeah, like I said, it was, um, it was very successful and, and very professional. And I think getting everything organized, getting all the equipment that was needed, getting all good quality stuff, um, being run very efficiently, and um, getting all of that for the first time is, is always a, a hard task. And so you wouldn't know it was the first time that, that you attend, it was, uh, it was very smooth. And so I think um, it shows, it's a good reflection of the objectives of ESO that they are um, viewing it as an important element of the conference. And yes. hopefully that continues in the future because um, as we said, it's, it's a key part of how we practice and how we uh, develop as a, a subspecialty within the region and raise the standards. So I think they did a great job in, in making um, the first strabismus wet lab that, very successful. Thank you. Thank you also for being in ESO 2024. Thank you, audience, for your, for your watching uh, ESO Studio.